Hey guys, today we're going to review and test these EVE 280 amp hour lithium iron phosphate aluminum case prismatic batteries. I picked these up on Alibaba from Dongguan Lighting New Energy Technology Company. And the price for these came to $116 delivered from China to the United States. Now I was told these are grade A cells, but that seems a little bit too good to be true based on the price and the fact that they came from Alibaba. We'll take a look at them and we'll see what we think based on the test results and how they match up to the data sheet from EVE. So one of the first things I checked when I received these batteries is whether or not the QR codes were intact. Typically on lower grade cells, these QR codes will be scratched off. However, that's not necessarily a 100% indicator of grade A or not. The first thing that caught my attention, however, is that there are four batteries here and I have two different style of QR codes. So you can see how this one says 3.2 volt, 280 amp hour, and then there's what appears to be a serial number on the bottom. And then there's this style here, which has a number on both sides and does not indicate voltage or capacity. Now I was asked what information you would get if you were to scan these QR codes, and I did try scanning them, and it simply returns the same numbers that are printed on here, so there's no additional information contained in this QR code that I could find. So one of the more recent versions of the datasheet from EVE does show the QR code style being used, and this does indicate version A in the top right corner. And you can see some additional information you can derive from the QR code, such as the serial number, production date, address code, specification code, there's a whole bunch of things listed here. So I also noticed a few characteristical differences between these batteries. The two batteries that have the suspected QR code, they're kind of pushed in just a little bit on the side and it almost sounds like a different material. So these two batteries have the QR code that matches the data sheet and you can hear what they sound like when I tap on them. And then these two have the suspect QR code. It almost sounds like it's plastic material or something like that. So what I want to do with one of these is just peel back this cover a little bit here, this heat shrink, and see what is actually under there, if it's aluminum or not. And it does appear to be aluminum in there. I'm not seeing any uh, issues per se. So then looking at the terminals up close, there is a little bit of scarring on them. However, I don't believe this indicates a used cell. I'm given to understand that they do charge and test these a couple of times. Now the next thing I want to do is verify the weight of these cells. According to the data sheet, the weight should test in at 5.30 kilograms, plus or minus a third of a kilogram. And the first one we're at 5.32 kilograms. The second we're at 5.33 kilograms. The third we're at 5.26 kilograms and the fourth were at 5.24 kilograms. Now those last two I tested, the tests at 5.2-ish, those were the ones with the questionable QR code. All right, so now to check the voltage of each cell. We're at 3.29, 3.28, 3.28, and 3.29. So they're all within 0.01 volt of each other, which is perfect. All right, so I went ahead and wired these batteries up for testing. I'm using a 100 amp DALI BMS for testing these batteries. I have the B minus terminal, which comes off the BMS and goes into the main negative of the battery. And this is wired in series with the next cell. This is 1 8 inch aluminum. And uh, I want to point out this is just a test setup before anybody criticizes how I have this done. I ordered these bolts special from Amazon. They are an M6 bolt, 8 millimeters in length with a 1.0 thread pitch. And it's a serrated flange bolt. So it's very important to have the right size bolt because you need to make sure it does not bottom out and as you're tightening it down, because if it bottoms out and you continue tightening it, you will crack and damage these terminals. And then the series connections just continue here until we have the main positive over here. I've covered how to wire a BMS many times already, but if you're new to this channel, uh, you'll have one wire that comes off that's black and that wire goes to the main negative terminal of your battery and then you just work your way up in series. So the first red goes to the first series connection, second red to the second series connection and so forth until your last red wire here goes to the main positive of the battery. And then additionally down here, I have a 125 amp Tom Zian DC rated circuit breaker, non-polarized. And I've got a negative terminal and then a positive terminal. So for charging this battery up, I have two of these iCharger X6s I'll be using. All right, guys, I had two iCharger X6s charging this around 8 amps or so. So it was a total of 16 to 17 amps. And this DALI BMS kept shutting off because the cells are not completely balanced. Now, a lot of the suppliers say they voltage match these cells, but 
that doesn't mean they're balanced. That means I took a voltmeter and then checked if it was 3.3 or 3.31, which doesn't really do much considering the uh, voltage curve of a lithium iron phosphate cell is very flat until you get to the beginning or the end of the cycle. So I just made some temporary balance leads with some alligator clips, which are the white leads you see attached to the battery. And those are feeding in through my iCharger X6, so it's no longer charging through the BMS. And here you can see the voltages of the various cells. Cell number one has already reached 3.60 volts, while the lowest cell is at 3.38 volts. So I'm just going to leave this run, and I believe this balance is at 2 amps. I'm not sure if that's 2 amps per channel, or if that's 2 amps as a whole. Alright, so we're pretty much done balancing here. Once it had finished the first time, I reconfigured it for a max voltage per cell of 3.65 volts, since that's what's indicated on the specification sheet. Uh, you can see now we're pretty much perfectly balanced. It's showing a deviation of 7 millivolts. So this value down here is the uh, highest cell minus the low cell. That should be finished any second now, and then we'll go ahead and start our capacity test. Now that these batteries are nicely top balanced, we're ready to begin our capacity test. So off of the BMS, I have the main negative that is going through a circuit breaker into this batrium shunt, and then it goes from the shunt to the inverter. The positive comes off, and the positive goes directly into the inverter as well. Additionally, on this shunt, I have this little blue wire, which goes up to the positive for the voltage sense cable. This is a three-wire shunt. It is not a four-wire. That's why there's only one uh, voltage sense lead. This goes off to a Batrium Watchmon 5, which is transmitting data wirelessly to this display. On this display, we can see the current voltage, the current amperage, the current power, the cumulative current in amp hours, and the cumulative power in watt hours. So I'm going to go ahead and turn on the circuit breaker now. And you can see we're resting at 14.40 volts. Turn on the inverter. And I'm using this standard electric space heater as a load. I'm going to put it on low, and it should give us between 75 to 80 amps. And we can hear a fan in the inverter has kicked on now that the load has been applied. And it looks like we are sitting around 75 amps. It's still warming up a little bit, but I don't think it's going to climb much more beyond that until the voltage begins to drop. All right, we're at 238 amp hours so far, and the voltage is just barely above 12 volts. It's starting to drop a little bit quicker now. So as a whole, we have 12.35 volts. So we're seeing a 300 millivolt uh, loss across this wiring and this breaker. And this breaker does feel quite warm. The BMS is actually quite warm as well. 3.11, 3.08, 3.04, 3.05, 3.06, 3.07, 3.08, 3.09, 3.10, 3.11, 3.12, 3.13, 3.14, 3.15, 3.16, 3.17, 3.18, 3.19, 3.20, 3.21, 3.22, 3.23, 3.24, 3.25, 3.26, 3.27, 3.28, 3.29, 3.30, 3.31, 3.32, 3.33, 3.34, 3.35, 3.36, 3.37, 3.38, 3.39, 3.40, 3.41, 3.42, 3.43, 3.44, 3.45, 3.46, 3.47, 3.48, 3.49, 3.50, 3.51, 3.52, 3.53, 3.54, 3.55, 3.56, 3.57, 3.58, 3.59, 3.60, 3.61, 3.62, 3.63, 3.64, 3.65, 3.66, 3.67, 3.68, 3.69, 3.70, 3.71, 3.72, 3.73, 3.74, 3.75, 3.76, 3.77, 3.78, 3.79, 3.80, 3.81, 3.82, 3.83, 3.84, 3.85, 3.86, 3.87, 3.88, 3.89, 3.90, 3.91, 3.92, 3.93, 3.94, 3.95, 3.96, 3.97, 3.98, 3.99, 3.10, 3.11, 3.12, 3.13, 3.14, 3.15, 3.16, 3.17, 3.18, 3.19, 3.20, 3.21, 3.22, 3.23, 3.24, 3.25, 3.26, 3.27, 3.28, 3.29, 3.30, 3.31, 3.32, 3.33, 3.34, 3.35, 3.36, 3.37, 3.38, 3.39, 3.40, 3.41, 3.42, 3.43, 3.44, 3.45, 3.46, 3.47, 3.48, 3.49, 3.50, 3.51, 3.52, 3.53, 3.54, 3.55, 3.56, 3.57, 3.58, 3.59, 3.60, 3.61, 3.62, 3.63, 3.64, 3.65, 3.66, 3.67, 3.68, 3.69, 3.70, 3.71, 3.72, 3.73, 3.74, 3.75, 3.76, 3.77, 3.78, 3.79, 3.80, 3.81, 3.82, 3.83, 3.84, 3.85, 3.86, 3.87, 3.88, 3.89, 3.90, 3.91, 3.92, 3.93, 3.94, 3.95, 3.96, 3.97, 3.98, 3.99, 3.10, 3.11, 3.12, 3.13, 3.14, 3.15, 3.16, 3.17, 3.18, 3.19, 3.20, 3.21, 3.22, 3.23, 3.24, 3.25, 3.26, 3.27, 3.28, 3.29, 3.30, 3.31, 3.32, 3.33, 3.34, 3.35, 3.36, 3.37, 3.38, 3.39, 3.40, 3.41, 3.42, 3.43, 3.44, 3.45, 3.46, 3.47, 3.48, 3.49, 3.50, 3.51, 3.52, 3.53, 3.54, 3.55, 3.56, 3.57, 3.58, 3.59, 3.60, 3.61, 3.62, 3.63, 3.64, 3.65, 3.66, 3.67, 3.68, 3.69, 3.70, 3.71, 3.72, 3.73, 3.74, 3.75, 3.76, 3.77, 3.78, 3.79, 3.80, 3.81, 3.82, 3.83, 3.84, 3.85, 3.86, 3.87, 3.88, 3.89, 3.90, 3.91, 3.92, 3.93, 3.94, 3.95, 3.96, 3.97, 3.98, 3.99, 3.10, 3.11, 3.12, 3.13, 3.14, 3.15, 3.16, 3.17, 3.18, 3.19, 3.20, 3.21, 3.22, 3.23, 3.24, 3.25, 3.26, 3.27, 3.28, 3.29, 3.30, 3.31, 3.32, 3.33, 3.34, 3.35, 3.36, 3.37, 3.38, 3.39, 3.40, 3.41, 3.42, 3.43, 3.44, 3.45, 3.46, 3.47, 3.48, 3.49, 3.50, 3.51, 3.52, 3.53, 3.54, 3.55, 3.56, 3.57, 3.58, 3.59, 3.60, 3.61, 3.62, 3.63, 3.64, 3.65, 3.66, 3.67, 3.68, 3.69, 3.70, 3.71, 3.72, 3.73, 3.74, 3.75, 3.76, 3.77, 3.78, 3.79, 3.80, 3.81, 3.82, 3.83, 3.84, 3.85, 3.86, 3.87, 3.88, 3.89, 3.90, 3.91, 3.92, 3.93, 3.94, 3.95, 3.96, 3.97, 3.98, 3.99, 3.10, 3.11, 3.12, 3.13, 3.14, 3.15, 3.16, 3.17, 3.18, 3.19, 3.20, 3.21, 3.22, 3.23, 3.24, 3.25, 3.26, 3.27, 3.28, 3.29, 3.30, 3.31, 3.32, 3.33, 3.34, 3.35, 3.36, 3.37, 3.38, 3.39, 3.40, 3.41, 3.42, 3.43, 3.44, 3.45, 3.46, 3.47, 3.48, 3.49, 3.50, 3.51, 3.52, 3.53, 3.54, 3.55, 3.56, 3.57, 3.58, 3.59, 3.60, 3.61, 3.62, 3.63, 3.64, 3.65, 3.66, 3.67, 3.68, 3.69, 3.70, 3.71, 3.72, 3.73, 3.74, 3.75, 3.76, 3.77, 3.78, 3.79, 3.80, 3.81, 3.82, 3.83, 3.84, 3.85, 3.86, 3.87, 3.88, 3.89, 3.90, 3.91, 3.92, 3.93, 3.94, 3.95, 3.96, 3.97, 3.98, 3.99, 3.10, 3.11, 3.12, 3.13, 3.14, 3.15, 3.16, 3.17, 3.18, 3.19, 3.20, 3.21, 3.22, 3.23, 3.24, 3.25, 3.26, 3.27, 3.28, 3.29, 3.30, 3.31, 3.32, 3.33, 3.34, 3.35, 3.36, 3.37, 3.38, 3.39, 3.40, 3.41, 3.42, 3.43, 3.44, 3.45, 3.46, 3.47, 3.48, 3.49, 3.50, 3.51, 3.52, 3.53, 3.54, 3.55, 3.56, 3.57, 3.58, 3.59, 3.60, 3.61, 3.62, 3.63, 3.64, 3.65, 3.66, 3.67, 3.68, 3.69, 3.70, 3.71, 3.72, 3.73, 3.74, 3.75, 3.76, 3.77, 3.78, 3.79, 3.80, 3.81, 3.82, 3.83, 3.84, 3.85, 3.86, 3.87, 3.88, 3.89, 3.90, 3.91, 3.92, 3.93, 3.94, 3.95, 3.96, 3.97, 3.98, 3.99, 3.10, 3.11, 3.12, 3.13, 3.14, 3.15, 3.16, 3.17, 3.18, 3.19, 3.20, 3.21, 3.22, 3.23, 3.24, 3.25, 3.26, 3.27, 3.28, 3.29, 3.30, 3.31, 3.32, 3.33, 3.34, 3.35, 3.36, 3.37, 3.38, 3.39, 3.40, 3.41, 3.42, 3.43, 3.44, 3.45, 3.46, 3.47, 3.48, 3.49, 3.50, 3.51, 3.52, 3.53, 3.54, 3.55, 3.56, 3.57, 3.58, 3.59, 3.60, 3.61, 3.62, 3.63, 3.64, 3.65, 3.66, 3.67, 3.68, 3.69, 3.70, 3.71, 3.72, 3.73, 3.74, 3.75, 3.76, 3.77, 3.78, 3.79, 3.80, 3.81, 3.82, 3.83, 3.84, 3.85, 3.86, 3.87, 3.88, 3.89, 